we're gonna make him a catio. And I think that looks really good. You enjoying being in there, catio? It's like you're outside, but you're not. As a pet owner, guys, you always fear the worst. Uh, a little over two weeks ago, our cat Sticks got hit by a car. Uh, we've had Sticks for about two years now, since he was a little baby. He was about two weeks old. Someone abandoned him on the side of the road. So yeah, when we found Sticks, he ran out in front of our truck and he ran into a pile of sticks and brush and hence his name, Sticks. It created a strong bond for us because we basically raised him when he was just a little baby boy. Um, but thankfully he made it out with just a broken jaw, but that means he's stuck inside for two months and he is getting stir crazy. So we have to do something about it. So what are we gonna do? Well, uh, we're gonna make him a catio. We're gonna give him a little slice of the outside, approximately 24 by 24 slice outside the window. And that way he can go outside. We're gonna show you all how to make it. So if you have this issue, your cat can't go outside for a while, then you can make it. Or maybe you guys have inside cats and uh, lucky you, we couldn't keep him in. He wanted to be outside, so <laughs> what are you gonna do? So we're gonna get started. We're gonna make him a catio. So I'm gonna do my best to take some measurements here on my cats in the way. It's gonna be about 14 high, 25 and three quarters. This go about 18 inches deep. That's more than enough room for a cat. So now that we have all the basic dimensions, we can go get our PVC plywood that won't rot, and then we can cut it up into dimensional lumber. Then from there, I can use my circular saw and cut it all in length. So we got everything cut and it's all ready to go. I gotta go home and finish cutting it up. Thanks, Dad. I appreciate all the help, you know. You're welcome, but now clean up your mess. <laughs> it's, it's every time I show up here. Why do I keep coming back? Did you forget how to use the broom? No? I got I gotta go. No, you gotta learn to use the broom. You gotta go. I taught you how to use a broom. You gotta clean up after yourself. I'm sorry, I, I got stuff I gotta do. I gotta go. Bye. I... How do you expect to ever come back to my shop? Use my shop then. I, I gotta go. Hey, hey, come here. I'll show you how to use it. I'll show you how to use the broom. So to give you guys a general idea of how this works, I've already drilled the holes in here. Now, I'm not gonna show this with everyone because it could get wicked repetitive real fast. Get as much of this off as possible because it's really liquidy. Try to get a little bit, a couple dots here and there because this will squeeze out like crazy. That should be enough. Attach that there. Ah, knock your stuff over, that's generally the second rule. Clamp that there, install that there. Squeezes it, clamps it, there you go. That's how you do it guys, and basically once you're done, you're done. You can still work with this stuff, you don't have to mess with it, it's all together. That's the great part about this, the glue holds it, but the screws, really, really good. Well guys, here is the first step is done. Like I said, the bottom is all in and it is about as perfect as I could ever ask for. So now what we have left is to figure the measurements for making the peak of the roof there and screening it all in. But that honestly should not be hard at all. I even checked it with a level and it's just a little bit out of level, which is good. You want it a little bit closer to this end. Now it's just about perfectly level here, but once there's the top and a cushion and a cat in there, it should be um, pretty, pretty strong. And uh, also on top of that, it, again, it will probably sag a little bit, which is what we want. So I think all of that, that you don't see any screws, 
you don't see anything on there. It needs a little bit of sanding maybe. But with this PVC, you know, you can kind of take it or leave it. But on to the next step of figuring out the top. Well, 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 you're still watching my video, so that must mean you want to see the end result. Basically, what we got to do is give this a good sand, put our wire screening in, or should I say our window screening, and I'm going to staple it down and cover it with these little strips here, so it looks a little nicer on the inside, so it's not just looks like someone stapled a bunch of screening on, which is exactly what I'm going to do, but like I said, we're going to, we're going to hide it. It's time to do the opposite of tra what Travis Scott says and a mask on, as it were. It's sanding time, baby. Okay, guys. Time to put the wood on. Well guys, it is done. The screen is in and I think it looks pretty good. So before I put the roof on, and it's harder for you guys to see in here, I want to show you how it all turned out. Outside, you don't see anything. On the inside, it's all pocket hold all together. I mean, I think that looks really good. You know, the thing is no one but me will ever see this or know this exists. But I think having all the screws in the inside, I think it really looks good. And check that out. I mean, that is, that is cool. It goes to show you with pocket holes and glue, you can get stuff done a lot faster than the old ways. I don't know if the old ways were a nail gun or something, but anyways, time to put the roof on. Glue in the roof on, glue in the roof on, glue in the roof on, in the lawn, on the deck. Man, better watch out. I'm gonna be having a good afternoon standing over this glue bottle. There we go. Bam, perfect. Now comes the hard part. I gotta get up in here. I gotta put the screws through. How I'm gonna do this? Well, you'll see. I gotta crawl into this thing. Sorry you guys didn't see that. I know it's unbecoming of a YouTuber. Catios together and the roof is on. Sticks is gonna be in luxury. Got my wife in the window. Sorry for the air conditioner sound, it's hot out. This is heavy. How is it? Is it up against the bottom there? Oh, sorry. It's uh, sitting against the bottom, like an air conditioner. You got that shut as tight as possible? Yep. There we go. She's in. Look at that. Now we gotta get the cat. Well, we gotta get the cushion first. Oh yeah. But look at that. That is pretty cool. Well guys, it's time for the big reveal. We got the move that blind. And I think I hear them coming. Here comes the bride. And there he is. That big old boy. Gargoyle. Gargoyle. Man, he's looking pretty good, but He's grouchy that he has to be inside. So are you ready, Sticks, for move those Lines. lines that you broke? Wow, what's that? I know. Look at it. It's a cat, yes, and he's Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, he's sniffing it. I was thinking he was gonna be scared of it for a while. <gasps> Maybe not. He's very particular about his cat beds, too. Yes, he doesn't sleep <laughs> on anything that's not cashmere, so we'll see. <laughs> what do you think? You like it? Ooh, it's, it's, it's me. It's dead. There you go. Checking it out. Sticks. Sticks. You enjoying it? Yeah, you are. 
You enjoying being in there, Cadio? It's like you're outside, but you're not. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. From our family to yours, it uh, really means a lot. You guys watch these videos, and uh, hopefully Styx is liking it. He's in there right now. Uh, if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe for more stuff like this. We're always going to be building things like this, some weird, some normal. Spoiling cats. Spoiling cats. What are you going to do? Uh, but anyways, yeah. Thanks, guys, for sticking Bye. around. Bye. Hey, Stig's got anything to say? No. That looks like a success to me. Yes, you <laughs> peasants, thank you for watching. <laughs> Look up at us. <laughs> Look up at us. You stay where you belong. Down there. <laughs> Sir, what is, your, what is your opinion on the current state of the stock market? Do you think Amber Heard or Johnny Depp will win? What is your opinion, sir? Oh. Okay, thank you for your opinion.